horror, the tragedy, the horrible tragedy which took place in R.G. Kar Hospital should shake our conscience. It is out brutalizing the brutes, a shame to the entire Bengal, a shame to India, shame to humanity. The cold hands of death has removed from our midst living, vibrant, dynamic personality to a young girl who is a sister, who is a daughter to all of us. India has rise. Bengal has seen reason. This is not the first time. In the recent past, we saw the atrocities of, on women on the streets, disrobing of a woman on the street, flogging on the street, public flogging, kangaroo court. All these are repeatedly happening in the state of Bengal. Is this the state? Is this a place where Kobe Guru Rabindranath Thakur said, where the mind is without fear and the head is held high? Chitta Jada Bhai Shunno, Ucho Jada Shir. Is this the Bengal that we see now? There should be concerted action by everybody against these atro atrocities. This has to end. Government has to take the responsibility for maintenance of law and order. Society has to come in unison all over India. We see that this effort has started. This shall not end. We should be able to make Bengal, India, a safer place for the, the women to live in. That is a great task. We, if we miss the bus now, we will not get it again. We have to come together. We have to keep together. We have to work together. Success is ours. As Vivekananda said, Jago, Uto, arise away. Stop now till the goal is reached. Yes, that determination should be there. All of us should hold hands and work together to see that our girl children are protected. Especially the campus violence has to end. Campuses in Bengal have unfortunately degenerated into places where Gunda Raj is taking place. This is not, this does not bring credit to anyone down the line. Government has to take the responsibility. All stakeholders have to come together. This is fight to finish against atrocities on women.